All right, let's go ahead and enjoy this music for a bit. All right, so shield is Y. A is swing, B is jump. X is menu, so honestly... Question is, yeah, we can ju jump and slash, ooh. And, okay, as, as usual, you can heal up. The question is... Okay, so... Those, those gems are just sellable items. That's not direct gold they're buying. Deal with, dealing with crabs. Okay, yeah, these gems are obviously what are going to be selling. Oh! Ouch! Holy cow! Oh, nice uh, drop for healing items, but of course this is probably just better to stand outside and rest up. And not go wrong with this music, though. I'm loving it already. Up, oh, little sandbars are run off my rhythm here. And traditional bump combat. Yeah, I'm I'm, hit, I'm hurting him back. Oh, we've looped, we've looped on the music. Let's see, how, how am I doing on... Okay, so 50 to level up, yikes. I want to gain a level or two. No idea how much, what the money supply is going to be like, though. Wow, yeah, that's, those little sandbars really throw you off. A little hitbox dissonance here, ow. No idea what the damage rolls are here, so it looks like it looks like the spiders here are the most beneficial enemies to fight in terms of drops. They always drop these rupee-looking things. Play enough Zelda to fully associate them. Yep, corner. I want to gain one level, then run back to town and just see how much I get from selling these things. Oh, what? Whoa, hi. I'm not supposed to be here, but at the same time, yeah, I just get wrecked. <laughs> it looks like you can uh, do some sequence breaking style things here. Ow. Oh, baby. <laughs> oh, nice power up just from one level. So, yeah, early Peninsula power leveling right in there. Take a look at the. You do the gems show up in the items, so you've got sapphire and topaz can be exchanged for money in shops. I'm just getting my butt kicked by bees here. This trumpet, though, oh, I love the trumpet here. Yeah, one shot. Take that. I do dislike having to go into the uh, full menu to... Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, okay, so... Oh, separate leveled up for swords and... And magic. Interesting. Anyway, if I can... Uh, take out a few of these guys and get some quick level up, I'm not going to complain. Let's get to at least level three. That ought to uh, be a good enough start. Yep. Get in the corner! Get in the corner! Think about what you did! <laughs> you need a spanking! Wait, wrong game. And you're gonna respawn. Nope, you're not. Oh, well, let's do it this way. Oh, 
Now, the, the main complaint about this game, compared to the previous ones in the franchise, is that it was too easy. So, Falcom released an expert version, which ramped up the difficulty, and I think made a few changes. I also think the time attack mode is limited to that. I can't say 100% for sure, but I just chose the base game. That's the only one that has the translation patch. PS2 version, I may I may replay. Just trying to use out, kind of use knowledge from playing this version to get through that. How how we doing on uh, experience? Up oh, wrong button. Ah, uh, getting there. A few more, few more kills ought to do it. Nice thing is, yep, <laughs> free healing. <laughs> So, so far, I'm enjoying this. Very good first impressions. Of course, I'll gladly take more money. I was hoping to knock you against the corner. Nah, not happening. Yeah, your friend's gonna let, uh, gonna leave you to get slashed to death here. And then take your place. Now, since this is a since this is a blind run, I am going to leave in a lot of stuff just for just for the sake of showcasing exploration, all that fun stuff. If I decide to do extra grinding, I'll do that off camera. But for now, this will suffice. Just want to get that other level up really quick. Yeah. Stay put. He's trying to attack me, but I'm faster on the draw. There we go. <laughs> I, I just love how the, co the confirmation purchase and level up sound are all the same here. Nice. So, yeah, I, I could see... Uh, I could see if you're going for a more optimized run of this... You start by just buying the Tall War and don't get hit. <laughs> oh, baby, this one one hit kills. And of course, later on, uh, we'll see Adol getting getting improved uh, combo abilities with the Sword Swing. So this is pretty basic. At the same time, it works. Hell, I'll take this over Lagoon any day. <laughs> I mean, just swinging a toothpick in that game. But uh, fairly similar combat between the two, in all honesty. Yeah, I'm taking three damage. I like it. Anyhow, yeah, quick, uh... Quick stop over in town, see if we can afford anything else. Highly doubt it'll be the case, but at the same time, we'll have an idea of what we can get. That's the gems. Oh, nice. Yeah, let's, let's, let's break through the tall wall right away. And we can afford uh, armor, too. And I will say this many, many times. Early preparation never hurts in East games. Okay, so I'm going to need 20,000 to afford everything on the next, <laughs> the next set. Uh, we are good for now. Different amounts of leather armor. Yeah, plus four. It's just, okay, so I don't know if the magic is tied to armor and so it's tied to sword. It's, uh, any, okay, so uh, lower dexterity, but I think the, the tech power more than makes up for it. All right, we're good to go for a little while at least. I'm going to kill everything in my path for the most part and just enjoy this. I'm having fun. Oh, uh, you're not the end. <laughs> Yeah, trying to walk diagonally up small slopes, that's what that's what throws the controls off a little bit. Alright, now we're ready to head for Foresta. And of course if we enter Foresta and find and people have turned into old men and women from the Earth Crystal being drained or playing the wrong game. Alright, so Okay, so oh, okay, so interesting uh a uh, new attack style here. So, yeah, yeah more, more of a thrust than a, than a slash. Little things like that, no complaints. 
No, I'm, I'm curious about something. Okay, cannot move while defending. I'm, I'm used to Y being attacked. I keep pushing that by accident. Anyway, we want to head north. Yeah, I'll, I'll gladly accept a one-hit kill against these things. Yeah, these uh, topaz are like worth a hundred gold apiece. If I wanted to grind for the next tier or equipment, I could do that. But I'm not going to. Okay, I don't need apples if my HP is full. That's actually what I, what I really like in uh, Super Metroid and other ones. You don't get what you don't need if it will drop. But sadly, that's uh, just not the case here. Oh. I ran right into that. Alright, full HP, here we are. Oh, immediate cutscene. And apparently I'm not welcome here. The monument with one of the villagers' legends engraved on it. Somewhere, a girl sleeps, her body encased in ice, beside a crystal. In a time when this world was covered in sandstorms, she came from a nation that glittered like gold. By using the water crystal, she saved many lives. But in so doing, she cast herself into uneasy slumber, dormant in the ice. In that time, lived also a sorcerer. Though he used all the power he wielded, he could not free her. He forsook his humanity to become a beast and slept alongside her. There will someday come a man with hair of red, bearing a sword. He will awaken those two who slumber. He is the fated one, and whither he goes, disaster shall follow. Well, uh, nice of them to be specific. Hey there, Adol. So you made it. It's a pretty interesting old legend, isn't it? That girl sleeping in ice is probably in that cave not too far off. Part that gets me wondering, though, is the bit about using the water crystal. You think about it, it's probably that alchemy stuff the Dorman's so fond of. Huh? Hey, you with the red hair! I don't know why you come to this village. So we have a guy literally named Kakariko. Uh, since the Zelda connection couldn't be any more blatant. But please, don't stir up any trouble here. You understand? I'm terribly sorry, Adol. I know you went to some trouble to come here. They have an old legend here that says a red-haired traveler brings doom with him. And since you have red hair... Well, I didn't come with a sword. I had to buy it. At any rate, I wouldn't worry about it. It's just an old fairy tale. The cave is directly north of the village. Please be careful. Well, I want to see what I can loot here. I could not move during that. Okay, well... Uh. Check the, we'll check the town and then come back and save. Ever since Stein found the light crystal some three years ago or so, the villagers have really started believing what the thing says. Don't think anyone else is staying at the inn. Alright, let's gather more info. I'll bet you that crystal in the legend really is in that cave. That would mean in the disaster it mentions must also be real. Hey, kiddo, I want to talk to you. Eee! Please don't talk to <laughs> Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, did you need something? Well, uh, I can only loot something from the Elder's house, so technically no. <laughs> okay, I won't talk to you anymore, kid. Okay, here's the Elder's house. Red hair, an adventure on top of that. This is a peaceful village. I humbly ask that you do nothing to cause trouble. By the way, you saw that bronze statue of me, right? Uh, no, actually. I see. I knew it would stand out if it wasn't in the middle of the village. It's west of the village. Please do take a look. Yeah, can I, uh, say yes and lie? You have? It's a fine piece of work, is it not? I want to put up in the middle of the village, but the others didn't want to. I still like it, though. And they're at all chained. A brush? 
Oh, red-haired traveler. Who knows what's going to happen now? Well, you seem to have your head on, on more straight than the elder, than the mayor does. Uh, oh, you have red hair. You come to see the cave, haven't you? The elders certainly won't want to let you in with that hair. I think the Willie may be able to help you, though. Now, you can't let anyone know I told you that, right? See what the... Uh, brush. Tool for polishing just about anything, so... Uh, Okay, so we got three heal potions, one antidote. Buying more is actually just way too expensive, unfortunately. <laughs> so, let's see. No one around here. It's an ill omen. I'm not letting any red-haired stranger into the cave. I don't want anything to happen to our village. Okay, so... Next shops. Oh, so things are slightly cheaper here. So just need uh, 1100, 11,000 for everything. Well, had I known that, of course, this is a blind run, so of course I didn't know that. Let's go ahead and get rid of the gems. An easy uh, 700, not bad. Okay, her. Uh, I read that the Sa Shamshir is the second best sword in the game from the Hidden Items Guide. But I'll try and stay with the. Uh, with consistency. Anyhow, I'm gonna bet Willie is over here. Yep. Bronze Statue of the Mayor. Statue of the Mayor is kinda tacky, don't you think? He's gonna have it put in the end of the village. The villagers weren't so keen on it, though, so they put it here instead. If I was going to build a statue, I'd make it of Stein, since he was a great adventurer. Huh? Wow, you're an adventurer too? Man, it sure must be cool to be an adventurer. Maybe I can become one myself. I can see it now. I can be just as cool as Stein. Name's Willie. Pleased to meet you. Right now, I'm supposed to be cleaning the mayor's stupid bronze statue. But it's kind of hard to do that since no one gave me a brush. Hey, buddy, you know, since you're an adventurer, I don't suppose you got a brush handy, do you? I'll buy it off you. Actually, yeah. Hey, you actually do have a brush. You're one strange adventurer, man. All I got is 20 gold, so how about selling me at that price? Well, uh, apparently yes. If you need anything, just come see me. I'll do what I can to help you out. Well, I need you to dye my hair. Oh. That looks like, uh, is that a character from Tales of Fantasia? Those two who went into the caves aren't back yet. I'm worried. Now what am I, now what am I supposed to do? Hey, stay with us! Nina's still inside. We were in this place that looked like some kind of great hall. I turned around and something strange had happened. We were fine until then. That's when we were attacked. Nina and I got separated while we were running away. Just like what happened three years ago, back when Stein was searching for the crystals. We have to help her. Who knows what could happen to her in there? There's no way we'd make it that far into the cave. Hey, you're an adventurer, aren't you? Can you go in and try to help the girl? Just a moment. Yes, this man is apparently an adventurer, but look at that red hair. Red-haired traveler is harboring our village's doom and all of our legends. You're right. He does have red hair. That just makes the situation mu that much more serious. I'll go. Don't be so foolish. You're still a child. There's no way you'd survive in there. Are you all cowards or something? There's a girl in there by herself! We have to help her, and soon! The only option that leaves us is to send the stranger. But Elder, are you sure about this? He has red hair! What about the prophecies? This girl is my foremost concern at the moment. Only one who is skilled with a sword stands any chance of saving her. Forgive us, red-haired traveler, but would you please go and help her? No! Oh, I suppose I must judge you. You call yourself an adventurer? Oh, that was Willie. Yep, but thou must. Excellent, you truly are worthy of the title adventure, and my, my, I know I've always changed for a moment there. <laughs> the traveler has agreed to go. Willie, I want you to serve as his guide. Got it. Why don't you go on ahead for now? I need to get something ready first. Uh... What? <laughs> I'll be your guide, but you go on without me. <laughs> well, I don't have to dye my hair at least. Let's save and, and check it out. Ha! <laughs> 
<laughs> Talk. Uh, the cave. If you're not... Oh, so, okay, so she's the proprietor of the inn. If you're not here for the cave, then I'm stumped. You mean that shiny crystal thing that's deep inside the cave? Stein found it around three years ago. I never really thought it was in there. That doorman fellow from Xandria has a crystal too. He says it's for research purposes, but somehow I kind of doubt that. Eh, let's save. Oh, we are just, uh... We are just uh, rocking this quiz game. You're in your debt, Traveler. He's in pretty bad shape. Could it be? Are these supporters of disaster which legend speaks? It's just terrible! The king has been turned transformed! Oh wait, wrong game. Up path to the cave. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, let's go around this way then. Nothing else here? Well, let's check it out. Really? Sorry for the wait. I'll get you in there er, er, to help the girl in no time flat. There's no way to open that door, actually. But there's a switch that'll open up another way. Yeah, <laughs> just leave it to me and I'll handle it. If you need anything from the village, get it before you go inside. Ah, I think we're good to go. 